In my previous video I showed you how to make your own 5 cell battery pack using 18650 battery cells. For this purpose, in this video I'll compare three type of battery cells to find out which is most worth the money for a battery pack. I'm testing battery cells from Panasonic, Sanyo and LG. First I charge them using my IntelliCharger i4, then I discharge them using an RC charger which shows the amount of amps when discharged up to 3 volts. This comparison does not include overcharge or undercharging the cells because that damages the cells and I want to use them for a 10 cell battery pack. Later I ordered another batch in order to make a larger battery pack for my electric longboard. After testing each cell, here are the results. A few of the cells were clearly lower than the rest. I decided to retest those and found that they were just as good as the others. 20 cells from Sanya showed an average capacity of 2887 mAh while costing about 4.5 euro per cell. The Panasonic cells had an average capacity of 2807 mAh while costing 3.65 euro per cell. And the LG had an average of 28.57 milliamp hour while costing 4.69 per cell. I would say that the Panasonic is the winner when looked at the price versus capacity. However, the maximum current on the Panasonic is at 6.7 amps, while the other two are at 10 amps. That is something to keep in mind if you want to draw more current. In my next video I'll show how I made 10 cell battery packs from these cells using a BMS which then I used for my electric longboard.